My dear people of River State, with humility and gratitude to God Almighty, I, Engineer Tele Ikuru, offer myself as a bridge builder and chief servant of the new River State. I make this solemn submission with the highest sense of purpose and duty as the most experienced and reliable hand prepared for over 16 years to safely pilot the ship of Tet traveling on the many rivers of social, political, economic, and sectional turbulence. My vision is to make River State a safe, good, peaceful, and prosperous land to live, invest, work, and relax. I envision a state that will be best destination for businesses, industries, and commerce, not only in Nigeria, but the world over. What I present here is a synopsis designed to give my good people of River State a new dawn of hope and secure future. The television for River State is therefore a clear and call on the people of River State to come together to support the life boil that will direct the ship of state to safe and prosperous harbor. As a roadmap for progress, our agenda will be people-centered and is entirely about the prosperity and happiness of our people, inclusiveness of non-indigenous, vulnerable groups, persons with disabilities, the unemployed, professionals, traditional rulers, as well as key partners, such as businessmen and women. Our legacies, as presented below, shall be the envy and pride of every rivers man and woman in a future they envision. The first will of progress, which shall be the will of prosperity. Under the will of prosperity, we will speak to our economic blueprint, which includes aggressive agricultural diversification and food security program. Environment, we shall also speak to issues of commerce and industry, energy and gas, and the need for our people to participate in these areas unequivocally and very strongly. Our second wheel of progress shall be the wheel of sustenance of law and order. As you are all aware, the issue of law and order and security of our people is primary in everything. Our third wheel of progress is about the wheel of education for self-reliance. We shall emphasize on education with a shift towards technical and technological education. Teachers' education and welfare will be paramount. Primary and secondary education shall be a focus as we shall embark on upgrade of infrastructure in this area. Our fourth wheel of progress shall be the wheel of infrastructural development. Under the wheel of infrastructural development, we shall implement a viable and functional transport policy comprising of air, land, and water transport. Roads, construction, railways, air transport, waterways, and so on will also be developed. Power supply. We shall work assiduously to ensure 24 hours uninterrupted power supply to all parts of the state capital, Port Harcourt, and one oil and gas free zone. By the end of our first time, all parts of the state shall have or enjoy uninterrupted power supply. Our fifth wheel of progress, and which is also very, very important to me, is the wheel of financial frugality, transparency, and accountability. My dear people of River State, let me use this opportunity to thank each and every one of you, and particularly to use the privilege to congratulate the Governor of the River State, His Excellency Yes Onwike. Today, he secured those 17 wells for River State. I congratulate him. Let me also thank him for giving us the opportunity to also be interested in River State and wanting to be leaders of River State. The way he managed River State is what has made it the envy of every person and indeed every stakeholder to become a part of leading our people. Let me thank him and wish every one of you the best. 
While wishing you the best, I look forward to our delegates giving me their votes and then the good people of River State also giving their votes to the People's Democratic Party and to me in particular. Thank you and God bless. Thank you.